to my Chanel. So today I will be administering makeup onto my own face without wearing my glasses. So this already poses as a challenge for me in normal everyday life. Um, I, for the most part, need to apply all of my makeup to my face without wearing my glasses, except when it comes to like putting my eyebrows on. Um, but anything other than that requires no glasses. It's a bloody struggle. I can't even do eyeshadow properly. Um, and literally when I go to like fancy events um, and I can't be bothered getting my makeup done from a professional, I literally look the same um, as I do every other day because it's just too flippin' hard to do like a full face. But we're gonna try and get a little bit creative today. Actually, we're not. I'm literally just gonna do my normal makeup routine plus a couple of other things. So let us see how gorgeous I can become. <laughs> this is gonna be very interesting. All right, let's go. All right, so um, I guess we have to take the glasses off now. Dun, dun, dun. My biggest fear, oh, oh crap. <laughs> My, my biggest fear of all time is that I'm cross-eyed or I've got like one lazy eye when I'm not wearing my glasses. Cause I can't, like I can't see, I literally cannot see. My glasses are minus nine. So let's put on some primer first. Um, it's just some shitty Maybelline one. I mean, not shitty soz, I don't know. It's drugstore. I don't know, do people not put primer on with their hands? Whatever. Okay. We have our primer on. I don't know, is this a thing? I always just feel like primer just is so ugh. This is the Tarte Double Duty Booty. Booty. Double Duty Booty. Um, face tape. It is so shit, but we're gonna use it anyway. Oops. It feels like it literally just misses my pores and it just really accentuates how disgusted my face is. And this is a little brush from Flower Beauty from um, Drew Barrymore's range. Um, so we'll, we'll just pump this. I also don't have a mirror anywhere here, so I just, I don't know what I'm doing. I feel like we need more. Oh, did I drop some somewhere? Okay. I hope that's blended in. It's probably not because this foundation just does not blend. What do we do next? Let's put on concealer. Where is my concealer? So I've got the little shape tape um, in the concealer because once again, don't use a lot of makeup. Unnecessary to spend all that money. So we're just going to put concealer under the eye. All right. Under the eye there. I don't, like, I just don't understand concealer under the eye bags. Everyone does it, right? But for me, it just feels like it really, once again, accentuates my flaws. <laughs> so we're just going to dab that in with my Kmart sponge. $2.75. Get on it. <coughs> Coronavirus! I really hope that's dabbed in. I really hope that's dabbed in so i bought this anastasia beverly hills contour palette a very long time ago it was probably like four years ago when it was like in fashion um and i've rarely used it because i don't know how to um but for the purpose of this video we're gonna give it a crack because we want to be snatched i don't even know what color to use but we'll we'll do that this this <laughs> does it that looks like poop. Look, it's poop because of the shape. So we're gonna, I think you're meant to like do it from the ear. Just, you wanna stop right there, you know? And then you go like that, right at the ear. Stop right there. Stop right there. Thank you very much. So you're meant to, I think you're meant to like go up. So you're meant to go like that, right? Am I looking good, guys? So you're just gonna go like that. Go like that. All right, just contour in the nose. Oh my God, it probably looks like I've got shit on my nose. So we've contoured the cheeks and we have contoured the nose. 
So now we are going to let's move on to the eyes. Somebody actually got this for me for um for Chris Kringle. So I still don't know who you are, but whoever you are, thank you so much. I still use it. Let's go in for like a um. We'll go for a glitter because you know you can never go wrong with glitter. Now let's put on some mascara. I literally only bought this because it said very vegan and it was like $3 from um, Chemist Warehouse. So it's probably going to give me an infection, but whatevs. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to form eyelashes. I also stopped getting my eyelash extensions done, which I'm very sad about. I needed to give it a break. I wonder if you can put eyelashes on without doing the mouth. <laughs> the mouth just makes it easier like look I look like a crazy bitch but watch this cute crazy bitch cute that'll do piggy that'll do now let's put on the eyebrows Browsings from Benefit. I literally bought this four years ago too, so it's probably off, but whatever. Okay, where's me eyebrows? I don't know where the arch is. Where's the arch? We're done with the eyebrows. Let's move on to some bronzer and some blush. You just want to get where you con. <laughs> I always say girls like to do it here too. So let's just do that. You know what? Let's just do the chin too because we've put on a couple kgs during lockdown. So. And now for the final touch, we're going to do lippies. Some lips. Now where's my lips? There you are. overlining oh, okay I feel like I'm doing a really good job with the lip liner am I <laughs> all right so we've lined our lips and then we'll just go in with this um, nude lipstick well it's not nude but it's yeah it's something yeah I think I stole this from my mum Wrong way, girlfriend. And here is the final look. <laughs> now I will put on my glasses to see what I look like. Trrr! I am still so blind that I can't even see um, from this far. So we're going to come closer. Oh my God. Is it bad? Is it bad? I think it's bad. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. So obviously the bronzer is a bit, it's a bit sharp and dark, uh, but I don't think I did a bad job. Like I'm, I'm literally just going to go wash it off now and I'm not going to go out in public like this, but considering the circumstances that I was put in, in order to apply this makeup, I think I've come out with a pretty decent result. She cute doll. She cute doll. All right, guys. Well, that comes to the end of another video. Thank you so much for joining me for another video. I appreciate it deep down in my soul. I would really appreciate it if you could subscribe to my channel, like this video, share it with your family and your friends. Um, and I would love it even more if you join me again next week. I hope you all have a blessed, successful 
life-changing, amazing week. And I'll see you again next week. Bye.